Hi, this is Annette from tipsformatypicalmom.blogspot.com and today I am updating a previous video that I have made about how to change the background or layout of your blog or blog. Um, because I, I know the screens look a little bit differently now. So first what you're going to do is come to Blogger, to your dashboard. If you have more than one blog, they're all going to be listed right here. You're going to scroll down to the blog that you want to edit and you're going to choose layout. And then right up here under these tabs, there's posting, settings, layout, monetize. The layout one should be highlighted. And you're going to choose pick new template. And you're going to make sure that you have the minima template chose. It's the very first template that you can choose in the blogger templates. So you're going to click save template and it says your changes have been saved. So now what I'm going to do is I'm just going to go back under layout and I'm going to click on page elements right here. Now we're going to come back to this in just a minute. So what we're going to do is we're going to open a new tab so that we can do a new Google search. And so what I typed in the Google search is free blog backgrounds for a blogger. You're just going to hit enter and there's a bunch of um, really awesome websites that you can choose. There's more cutesy ones that are scrapbooky or there's still Pizam. Um, but I, I like these new ones. There's Simply Chic Blog Backgrounds or the cutest blog on the block .com. Um, We're just going to choose the cutest blog and then what you do is you just scroll down. Now they offer custom blog design, but I'm going to teach you how to do that in a different tutorial, so you don't have to pay for it. Okay, um, so what you're going to do is you, right up here you can choose um, home, um, website design, blog to book, custom designs. Right over here they have new Valentine's Day blog backgrounds. So you're just going to click on that image, and depending on what time of year you're looking at this, you'll there's a bunch of different ones that you can choose from. And then what you're going to do is you're going to just scro scroll down and here's a listing of all of their blog backgrounds. So I'm just going to click on one and then you're going to scroll down again. It has the instructions on how to add this, but what I'm going to do is just show you how. You're going to triple click in the copy and paste this code. That way it highlights all the text or you can just click and drag down to make sure that it's all selected. Then you're going to right click and choose copy. And then we're going to go back to our blogger tab. We should be on the page elements under layout. And we're going to scroll all the way down and at the bottom it says add a gadget. We're going to click that and then a new window pops up and you're going to choose HTML JavaScript. You're going to leave the title blank you're going to click in the content box, right click, choose paste, and then click save, and you're done. That's how easy it is. You're going to scroll back up, and you can view the blog, and we'll see what it looks like. There it is. And then same thing as before, when you scroll down, the blog background just stays there. Just only your words float over the top. Um, one disadvantage of using these kinds of backgrounds is that their little ad is, um, there's a little ad button for their cutest blog on the block place. Um, so in the next tutorial I'm going to teach you how to create your own blog background using Photoshop. So make sure to visit my website. It's tipsfromatypicalmom.blogspot.com and have a great day.